the, the toll express lane signs. Uh, have a sign underneath them that says, uh, it says uh, $25 plus toll for violation. <laughs> and so I'm like, oh, so think about it for a minute here. I'll give you a minute. Think about that. It says $25 plus toll for violation. So I think about that and I think, well, wait a minute. If I pay the toll, then where's the violation? So you're going to violate me for paying a toll? I mean, can't you just like, if I have to pay the toll anyways, how do you say that? How do I, how do you get away with charging me a violation? You can't just be like, oh, we're violating you and making you pay the toll also. Like, it's just kind of weird, I think. I mean, is that really the way you get people to comply is by fear, <laughs> intimidation and extortion? <laughs> uh, $25 plus the toll for violation. Then if I pay the toll, then shouldn't that just be... Shouldn't we just be square then once I pay the toll? <laughs> yeah, I don't understand it. Like, what's the violation? What, being in the express lane without paying ahead of time? I don't understand. <laughs> I mean, because obviously you got all this, all these gadgets and all this, uh, you got all these, uh, gadgets up there to, to make sure people can't get away, can't cheat it. So how do you justify the violation? Like, if you get in that toll lane, you pretty well know that you're going to have to pay for it. So, where's the violation? I don't know. Alright. I I gotta pay attention here. Alright. Yep, so this is, uh, this is essentially the same, uh, kind of route that I took the last time I was up here. I do recall this. Uh, next exit, there we go. 
wonder if I'm pronouncing it right when I say that. Apalaka. Seems right to me. Apalaka. Doesn't sound right. Apalaka. 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 I don't know. See, I got 4.3 miles to go. 1.4 miles to go to my exit. And I'll be dumping off this air trailer and uh, bobtailing. One mile to right and take the exit. Um, for the time being, after that, till I pick up the next load tonight. Uh, which uh, the boss said it picks up at midnight. But in a lot of cases, we're able to get these loads early. So hopefully that'll be the case. Okay, hopefully I'll be able to pick it up before midnight. Take the exit on the right toward Northwest 37th Avenue. Because I do have uh, a good few hours left on my clock today, and if I um, end up having to sit around and wait until midnight, that's going to uh, kill my clock, I think. So I don't know. I'm not sure how that's going to work out. distribution on the windshield but it does not work that way it kind of just puddles it up right there in the middle I mean I don't know I'm guessing it's probably better than it would be if it was just like a regular normal sprayer from the hood but it's uh I don't know it seems kind of counter uh counter effective honestly something I could do to kind of jerry-rig it to make it work better. I bet there probably is.
forgetful about it and he's coming over. He's coming over and he's forgetful. Alright, I'll be right back. <laughs> 